and welcome back to this safe mode stream of Time Spinner. Um, so last time we found out a whole bunch of stuff. You know, it would just take way too long to go through all of it, quite frankly. Um, basically, we traveled a thousand years into the past and now are trying to exact our revenge against uh, Lachian, who have invaded our home and wrecked everything to shit. Uh, yeah, that, I've already been there. I mean, it, it can be fine to just download the VOD, but I find that like, if, if you want proper quality, you gotta do a local recording. <laughs> because the VOD is always going to be lossy. Like, maybe you had an internet lag spike or something, and that's a bunch of frames lost. And that's just no bueno. Uh, where should I get it? Over here. I mean, that, that's cool and all that you have a good connection quality. Um, I find my connection quality is definitely better since, uh, since I reset my computer. But I'm pretty sure it was a network configuration issue that I wasn't seeing. That was just screwing everything up. I'm not sure if it would have. I I honestly need to properly take a look at that and see if any of that would have helped. So let's keep going out here. This is the trying to establish some peace with the uh, Lachium. What this bleakness exactly is.
Also, I still need to, to work on uh, putting up the last part of uh, Virtue's last reward. I've been kind of sitting on that for a little bit because I, I know I need to split it up a couple of ways. Yeah, provided that the test is successful, which so far I have no reason to believe it's not going to be. Um, the first part of Zero of uh, Zero Time Dilemma is indeed going to be two weeks from now. Because I do not stream against Desert Bus. Somewhere in this area, I'm probably going to find the item that lets me swim. Oh. Who, who are you? I... What? Something's familiar about you. I am not with the Lucky Emmy, despite what I look like. I'm Linnaeus. Are you with the relations? Yeah. Aristotle's worried about you. Well, of course she is. I'm Ramada, our medic. You okay? Yeah. No. I found this man wandering the caves. He's got the bleakness and bad. I need help getting him back to camp. The bleakness? He must be new. Help me get him back and I'll explain. Report. I found this man wandering the caves. He's a second lieutenant by his uniform. Must have been from another unit. He looks bad. Bleakness got, uh, bleakness got him worse than most. I may be able to help him. Or let's get him comfortable. What's the bleakness? The curse of this world. Any of us who are away from Vola too long get it. The most of the minor sickness with aching pains and a sense of longing. For others, it's much more deadly. Do the Lucky Emmy have it? Sure, they all come from from Valette after all. That's probably why they got so violent. Hey, thanks for your help in finding the others. But you're stuck here, huh? For now. Lucky Emmy took control of the portal, so we're not about to get any reinforcements. No matter, we'll do what we can to survive here with what with whatever we have. I like your attitude. But with so few of my unit left, we'll have trouble even surviving on this forsaken world. However, you look like a warrior, gifted with magic too. Could you help us while my soldiers recover? What do you want? We're not going to make any headway with the Lakiemi, when we can't even protect ourselves against the local wildlife. If the camp is to remain safe, they need to be culled. I would have you slay 15 of the plant bats in the surrounding woods. Ensure they don't encroach on the camp. Sounds easy enough. Good luck. Linnaeus, right? Nellis says you're quite the fighter. How are you feeling? Some scratches, some bruises, nothing I can't handle. I'd offer you some healing salves, but I'm dangerously low on supplies. We've been stuck here for weeks since the Lucky Amy took control of the portal back to Villette. With the casualties we've suffered, and the young soldier taken care to take care of. I've run out of a lot of necessities. I go out into the forest to collect more herbs, but well, you've seen how they, how dangerous the fauna is on Lachian. It's nothing I can't handle. Sure, you have those orbs. You must be of high birth. High birth. Only those of high birth ha have that kind of power back on Valette. 
I can't ask you to, enda to endanger yourself, but if you could bring me some herbs, it, it would go a long way toward helping us. And I could make you some salves, too, of course. Sir, what do you need? I've seen the herbs I need chewed up around the woods. I think the forest rodents must hoard them. Could you hunt down? Could you hunt them down and bring me four herbs? I probably have that already. These herbs you need? Thank you. Yes, these will help a great deal. I'm no soldier. Even those rodents would have given me trouble. But I can make healing salves for these. Maybe help this guy. You know, I, I had a dream the other night about stopping the war, returning home to Villette. Your familiar was there, the dragon. Maybe you're really, he maybe you're really here to help us. Maybe I am. Anyway, if you need any salves, talk to Sekus. He'll sell them to you. Thanks again. Of mice and medicine. I'm Linus. You look distracted. Hmm? Oh, just thinking about something Haristil said last night in bed. You share a bed with, Her with Haristil? Are you lovers? We have a loving relationship, yes. Haristil, in any way, doesn't matter. She was angrily going on about how the Lucky Emmy stranded us here to be consumed by the bleakness. And all I can think of is, well, Valette did the same to them originally, banished them here to slowly die. That's why Alana was so mad, why there was war. But that will change now. Yeah. Anyway, my priority is just keeping everyone keeping everyone alive. Speaking of, I'm trying to brew up an old, an old remedy that the army uses. I think it will help this young man. He keeps slipping into unconsciousness. But I don't have the mushrooms we always used. The soldiers used to gather them from the from mushroom towers in the caves. Could you find some for me? About two would do it. Would they? Thank you. Oh, watch out though. Harrisville once told me they made dangerous spores when disturbed. There's always a catch, isn't there? Do I have them? Uh, I do not. I only have one, I think. Hmm. Where to next? There's so many options. Like, when this game opens up, it opens up wide. Uh... So back to the present. Okay, that's not the place that I was looking for. I might be able to discover a little bit something new. For instance... Ah, okay. That's a B door. That's an A door, okay. Let's see. So I remember what I was looking for, I just don't remember where it was. I think... oh, okay. I think it might have been here. Is it? So many options. I'm gonna bid on here, yeah.
No. And that is... yeah, that's blocked. Yeah, there we go. This is what I was looking for. Sealed caves. Oh, Looks like they took quite the tumble. What's this? A key card, yes. Ah. So I can save again. I am mad with saving power. Oh, and that requires the A level key card. Well, that's fine. If we go back to the library, there's a couple of, uh... There's a couple of B-level uh, doors that we can open now. For the military hangar, I guess? And yeah, I have not been reading these out loud. Mostly because uh, for the entire first half I had uh, Cocoms, so... Oops. Looks like Linnaeus, uh, Linnaeus and Yorn have always have always had a bit of a um, competitive relationship. that for a little bit later at least go into the um ah, just a save point here but yeah when you start the game there is no indication that these are um that these are fast travel So I just kind of casually found two more of them in the past, and I was like, okay. But then you find out that you can fast travel to those points, and it's like, okay, well, it's a good thing that I actually found that. <laughs> oh, 
Oh geez, I didn't see those. I'm leveling up pretty fast here. I feel like I might be punching above my weight class and surviving pretty well. Jeez, I'm out of okay. I didn't realize I was out of aura. With a mask allowing breathing and movement underwater, finally. So I was right about this area eventually leading to swimming. However, it leads to swimming in the, in the present, not the past. That's her up. But th this game kind of reminds me a little bit of um, The Messenger. It seems like a lot of the same idea. In at least some of the story execution and also some of the level design. But the actual base design of the game is heavily based on Symphony of the Night. And there was nothing here. Of course there wasn't. It's, I think it's going to be real cool on December 5th when uh, we have our Sunday Ultimate Shuffle where we're going to be playing all of the Archipelago games and um, the way that it's currently organized I'm going to be playing this 
and like I'm really enjoying this so far. So there's oh damn it there's no way I'm going to be able to get in there and find the emperor now what time Linnaeus change time yeah if the lucky enemy didn't uh, don't win the war a thousand years ago maybe they won't be as strong now and then I can come back with those time gates and get my revenge while he's weak. That's all you gotta do. It's change time. I have complete disregard for time travel philosophy. Oh, one more too many. Oh. Emily. Actually, do you know what the bleakness kind of reminds me of? Just from the descriptions that are given in the game? Uh, it kind of makes me think of mana withdrawal from the Blood Elves in World of Warcraft. There's probably a couple of things that we can do here. Lucky me, son.
Interesting. Maybe this is Selden's dad we're talking or uh Mune is the dad we're talking about. Okay, so there's some map data as well. You know, it's like some various histories. I have to wonder if this is some Kickstarter thing. I feel like th this is definitely the sort of thing that's like... Yeah, you back us at this level on Kickstarter, and we'll put your picture in the game. Some more of that uh, blue-haired Lakini officer. They definitely hit it off. I'm guessing you mean 3.9% of Steam users or players on Steam have gotten it. definitely get the sense that this blue-haired soldier is actually Lune's dad. Greetings, child. Have you come to worship the Eternal Mother? Who's that? My goddess, the Eternal Mother. We are all a, we are all her children. She decides when we live and when we die. When it is your time, may you greet her with acceptance. Sure. I'm not going to be able to access that one for a while, I don't think. Uh, let's see. I think that's about all I can do in the present right now.
other. I think that was different, actually. I. I don't know. Let's see, where to next? I guess we could go down to uh, the Caves of Banishment here, now that we can actually go underwater. Might be something interesting for us. Oops. Yeah, uh, I... But I am also into one particular um, idol game. Uh, the one that I play is uh, Synergism. Sand. Mushroom. It doesn't take too long. Oh, I just realized I'm basically out of aura and to fight with other weapons until I build that back up. Why don't I just beat on this specific one for a little bit? There we go. That's what I was looking for. I didn't got poisoned. I wonder how I get down there. Increase all sounds by like twenty five percent. Mice in game sounds? I'm not sure what you mean by mice, but I can. Switch the game audio up a little bit. Oh, mic and game sound. Unfortunately, I'm not really able to increase. Oh, I can. Can. Uh, 
uh, boost the gain a little bit. Is that any better? Test, test. Test, test. I can add a gain in regular OBS too. Regular OBS is fine, Jewel. I I had the I had the peak limiter on a little too high. I have turned it down. How's that? I'm guessing uh, you had me cranked up a little bit high previously. Ooh, okay. Thanks. Yeah, I'm um, I'm just gonna use a warp shard. Yeah, that's fair. I'm still uh th this is still a relatively new uh setup that I only got to test for like half a stream before the computer froze. Beads. Yeah, I don't know why. I'm, I'm gonna be honest. I don't. I don't know why you're so insistent on me using Streamlabs OBS. I don't really need Streamlabs OBS because I don't use Streamlabs features. I can see I can see you being more used to Streamlabs OBS, but I'm more used to regular OBS. And they mostly have all the same features, it's just that uh, Streamlabs OBS has Streamlabs integration. And I don't especially need Streamlabs integration. Eventually I'll have like follow notifications and things like that, but uh, I plan on doing my own features for that. Oh, I just... I haven't had this up. I really should have. Xylan followed. Thank you Xylan for following and thank you once again for being here earlier. And the, the whole point with uh, making my own is that I get to decide exactly... You're not an idiot, Joel. It's not that you're dumb, it's that I have skills that you don't.
But yeah, like, I, I feel if I make my own thing, then I get to decide how it looks, how it behaves, what it plugs into. And I'm able to basically build my own brand and not have to depend on, on something someone else built for me. Oh nice, I just realized my health. 420 blaze it. Ooh, ice orb. Creates deadly icicles on the ground. Oh, let's give them a try. Hey, I can see the I can see these being useful. I can't see using these very much for myself. your stickers a lot. I, I do hope that you're able to eventually uh, get affiliates so that you can use um, your stickers as emoji, but it is a long road. I am only at 37 followers. As you can see from the neat little bar on the bottom right. The, the hard part isn't so much the people chatting, in my opinion, it's more um, getting the number of followers. At least that, that's what it is for me. I've been... my followers have been going up very slowly. I almost fell into those spikes. I'm right now 27. I'm doing pretty good. good. Yeah, it it can it can be hard to get started. Don't feel too bad about it though. I mean, a lot of people have that kind of difficulty going on. Like, either they can get a lot of followers weekly somehow, usually by playing like 
the newest and hottest games, but they don't get anyone stick around to talk. Or they can get some good conversations going, but it's always the same three or four people and they can't get any more. Like they can't get the 50 that they need. And that's the problem I'm having. Yeah, I tend not to watch new games either. Oh, hi! Ancient Frail. Okay, so you're just gonna vomit at me. That's your- that's your attack. bit sad honestly that now that I have double jump I don't really need to time stop all that much. So Alana was sent to lock him to basically as an as, as an ambassador, and then she ended up going power mad. saying about time stop not being useful. But yeah, you don't you don't need to be you don't need to worry about uh, watching new games with this stream. This game's about three years old. That brings me up here.
go ahead and save again. And go through the boss door. This must be the Maha of Asmodeus, the thing that destroys Bullet and lets Lachian become the undisputed power. Well, not this time. Whoa! That's fine. I can kill you from either side. And the air here. I've never felt so light, so... so right. Let's do this. Whoa! Oh crap! Holy! What the fuck was that? Ow! 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 Oh, holy crap! Other way than this. I'm learning your attacks. Yeah. It suck. <laughs> the portal is gone. Well, that's safe. Even if they are, everyone's stuck here now. Um, I guess let's go back to town. Well, quote unquote town. We heard a rumble, a rumble from below. What happened out there? I destroyed the thing that the Lakiemi had guarding the portal. And the portal is liberated! I'm sorry. When the mall was destroyed, so was the portal. Let's see. There is no going back. I... I have your mushrooms. We weren't kidding about those spores. Are you okay? I'll be fine. Let me brew these up. <coughs> Lie still. You're still very weak. Can you hear me? Can you understand me? Don't try to speak. Your throat is, is extremely raw. The bleakness has hit you hard. Thanks, Aeneas. I think you'll survive.
Carmela? Hmm? Oh, hi, Linnaeus. I'm glad you stopped by. I've been thinking. If I can ease the bleakness a bit, even temporarily, it might help me treat some of the underlying health issues that are making it so bad for this man. He's not getting much better. In the caves where we first came through the portal, I remember seeing some plasma crystals. I'm not sure how effective they'll be for medical purposes compared to real plasma, but it's worth a shot. And you want me to get one for you? If you would. It's too dangerous for me to- Yeah, I got it. No problem. In fact, I already got one. Is this the crystal you need? Yes, thank you. Let's hope it ha let's hope it help. Ah, let's hope it helps. While you were gone, because I was totally gone, guys. While you were gone, I slept and dreamt. I was back in Valette before this war. I saw the Emperor Volterilis rise to power with his powerful magic. I saw how they took anyone with magical gifts to raising, raising their cloistered castles, and how they treated those who had no magic, like second-class citizens. Then all, then all the Valation em Emperor's enemies gathered up and forced, the, uh, forced through the portal to this world. In the war, the things they've done, and being here now, seeing what the bleakness can do. And? It was just a dream. I don't know. I guess I can just understand why the Lucky and me are so angry. Willing to fight back. Their actions may be wrong, but I can't say Valets have, uh, Valets have ever been any better. Maybe I'll talk to Harrisol about it. Sure. I can still hear their shrill cries out there. Even if the plant bats aren't culled, I may not be able to protect our position. Right, I'm on it. We do not have the luxury of time here. Let's see. We got 91% of the past already. But we've hit four hours, so that's the end of the- actually, no, it's not the end of the stream. We still going for two hours. Unless, of course, the computer decides otherwise. Which, so far, doing good. Just throw me a soft time and go through that fine. That's what I meant to do. Oh my goodness, these guys hit hard. Oh 
Allows her to breathe in polluted or low oxygen environments. I'm going to gather that's probably pretty useful. Oh, thank goodness a save. that platform because I thought it was going to keep moving. Whoa. This is not going well. Okay. Okay. Edge of an area there. See what there is top side if hmm. not sure that I can actually make that. Okay, no, I can't like air dash or something. Alright, well, let's just keep moving forward then. Anadeus of the Laboratory, 1062A. Do you think it'll work? We're talking about time travel here, of course it will. Enza seems so sure. So sure he sent one of his volunteers through, and did we ever hear from them again? Well, he thinks it's almost done now. Let's just hope we're not the next volunteers. I'll have fun with that, Jewel. Oh, jeez. Let's jump directly into the force field. That's a great idea. It didn't work the first time. What made me think that it would work now? Interesting. So they basically did an entire line of robots based on instinct creatures. Oh, this is unpleasant. It's too high for me to get. It just kind of reminded me of the uh, factory from uh, Super Mario RPG.
Oh, jeez. Orb. A fleshy oculus that slices through your unwitting foe. Ooh. A bit slow though. A key card for that. Oh. Uh oh. Something just escaped. Oh yeah, that seems like a great idea. I'll just take this organic material that we have no idea what it is and implant it into friggin' into the embryo of a Windarian co- oh jeez. Okay, that is... That is messed up. Oh my goodness. Oh, that was a map. Okay. This is creepy, and that's on purpose. Rock me out of days. Not really sure what I was attacking there, but okay. Food synthesizer. Also, these come back.
Oh jeez. Okay. It's fine. I'm fine. I'm not fine. Okay, save. Sure, how to get up there? So I don't think. Even if I have that, I can't stand on the lasers. Yeah, I know. That ain't gonna do it. Okay. Tolari attachment harnesses telekinesis to glide across the ground. Oh. Interesting. So now I can dash. You have given me some power here. and save. Oh. Interesting. So I need to be specifically standing at the save point in order to heal up. Oh, that's interesting. All right. Looks like it's full of old historical documents about the War of the Sisters. Nothing seems that useful, though. History. Passing the biotech DNA into a grown like Yemi, you know, woman. Yeah, I can see why they would be worried about Amadeus. He seems a bit unhinged.
oh yeah, he's a lot stronger, but he's a monster now and has no skin. Can't wait to meet experiment well. There's a box store right over here. Lab. You must be Lunaeus, yes? Welcome to my laboratory. And you must be Genza, the one behind Lakiem's thick experiments. My reputation precedes me. I am the man behind all, all that Lakiem has accomplished. I'm fairly sure Queen Elana gets some of the prize. <laughs> the weekly end account. But going back on her loyalties on her deal, trying to rid us of the demon she signed. Unsuccessfully, I might add. What do you mean? Oh, you poor naive girl. They never went away, not really. They assured Luckyum's rise in power, even as they for uh, foment chaos in our realm. And I won't have that. Order must be absolute. Science will replace their obsolete powers, and then Lakiam will, will be finally free in a way a lot of could never accomplish. But that's neither here nor there. You're the time messenger from that backwards Windaria. It's a pleasure to meet you. Like what I've done with the place? I finally got a working no thanks. And I'll be tying it into an experimental portal we've constructed, one that can teleport us anywhere. With the two combined, we'll be unstoppable. You can't use that! You haven't been trained! <laughs> I've trained all my life. The sacrifice you, you'd be making, you know how it works? How it erases you from history? A pity, yes, but a small price to pay. I've already sacrificed my humanity to save, uh, to make Lakim strong. Let my morals slip from the good of the nation. Good? <laughs> Hardly. What do you know of good at sacrifice anyway? You've never seen true power. Not been achieved. I've sacrificed everything to come here to stop Nubius. Ah, of course. Your mother. What? Oh, Linnaeus, have you missed me? What trick is this? No trick. I love you. But you left me. What? Abandon me to Nubius. To death. My own daughter. After all I'd sacrificed. No, that's not... You failed me. No. Not you, Genza. Hey, welcome back, Jewel. Oh. Oh, jeez. Hi. Oh, 
little high. Okay, new attack. New attack. Ow. I'm not really sure what happened there. Okay. Uh, item. Okay, so obviously I'm not reading that attack very well. Oh, okay. But Genza's doing kind of a melee attack at the same time. That's what's getting me. strong. Your bastard. Says the girl with no father. But that's not true, is it? What do you mean? You must know we never cured the bleakness. Even once we reconquered Valette and gained access to their plasma, we would never be the same. The longing in our people, leading us to explore the stars. Quick to anger, quick to melancholy. These are the legacy of that sickness. And the lucky Emmy blue hair, of course. Sound familiar? You must realize by now. <laughs> the same man you want dead. Our glorious Emperor Nubius. Is your father? I suppose that makes sense. I don't care. I have no love for him. He attacked my clan. He killed my mother. You will die. Very well. Just do me one favor. Why would I? Don't let my work have gone to waste. When you take the throne as the rightful heir, rid us of the demons once and for all. High security access. The doors I could open with this. It's time to end this. So I get the sense that we're not that far from the end. But this is not a very long game. I'm enjoying the heck out of it, but it doesn't seem to be a very long game. So we might actually be done this dream. And I would really prefer that, honestly. Emperor's Tower. Oh, geez. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Oh, better armor. Good. Um... Oh, geez, that advisor robe I got forever ago was a bit of an upgrade. Uh, I got the military armor now, so... And any upgrades here? The advisor has me.
taking too long to kill you. Okay, so that was just for Max Orop, apparently. There's no platform there, that's it. So this is definitely giving me some uh, Castlevania clock tower vibes. I'm gonna guess there's a save room on this side. Yeah, there it is. So how how's your how's your wowing been going? Uh Jewel. Oh, that's a, that's a rough jump. Oh my goodness. Oh, how's it go how's it been going in general? Oh, these are really tight jumps. I don't think I can make that one. Ah, fair enough. Stand. That should not have cost me almost all my sand. Right, this is it. Time to meet my father and end this. Linnaeus, I've been waiting for you. Nubius. That's Emperor Nubius. Father. Prefer. Never. Not after what you did. To your mother? Whatever. She spurned me. I offered her everything. I loved her. And she spurned me. It was unintentional. But she deserved death. 
How dare you! You invaded our world, colonized our people, and slaughtered my clan. All for what? Power? The time spinner? We lack Yemi. I've ever yearned for more. To explore the stars. To reach into the farthest reaches of the universe. To understand. To ascend. There must be sacrifice for such progress. Sacrifice is a choice. What you do is murder. Matter of perspective, but come, Linnaeus, you are here now, the very pinnacle of Lechium. You could join me. Take what your mother refused. But you still breathe. <laughs> you spurred me too? Your own father? You're no better than her. You don't deserve me. I don't care. Bring it, old man. Oh jeez and hell, what the fuck was that? Oh my goodness! Two health left. Everything hurts. Ow. Oh. Ow, ow, ow. I'm gonna need all my items for this one. Okay. Let me have that weak ass attack. Linnaeus, please. Ow. I was late. Uh, items. God damn it. Yeah, I'm probably not going to be successful in this attempt. Oh, jeez. Maybe I lost it in a uh... after dying or something. Uh, I am out of healing items. It. Well, that's it. That was easy enough. I'm slowly learning. 
not really sure how to avoid that. Or that. That one is simple, not necessarily easy, but simple. For some reason, I thought it only hit the three. In fact, I'm pretty sure it did before. Um. Oh, come on. Did that hit me? Yeah, that just hit for three that time. What, what, what's the deal? I don't have the paying time for that. Uh... Oh right, I do have you. Okay. I guess we're not done. It's over. Now what? Been working to kill him for so long. I don't know what else there is. My client is still gone. I'm the rightful heir here, I suppose. But now this and all the others. I could be real lucky I'm now. Can I make it better, maybe? Or return to lucky I'm then. Help them rebuild and change time once more. Yes, most of my clan gone. This would never be a home. I made more of a home back back then with Nell. I'll help them rebuild Lakiem, force the demons out, make this future a better place. I left Lockheed in chaos, rulerless. I don't know what will become of them. I never want to go back there. Living in the past, I know. Oh, maybe I can make things better for the past. But this whole empire is tainted. I'm glad to be rid of it. My future is elsewhere. Do you think we'll see her again? I don't know. At least she did some good here. I miss her. Linnaeus? Linnaeus! You're back! Can't get rid of me that easily. Is everything done? Taken care of? Why did you come back? It's not my home anymore. 
my home is here. I think I can do some good. Start, start building the site for the stranded Galatians. Peristal, I understand you have volunteered to lead the efforts in rooting out what demons remain. Yes, Your Highness. I'm happy to let my, my aid as well, Your Highness. I think Lakiam has the potential to be something great. Thank you. We'll uh, form a joint task force then. The first step toward reuniting our peoples. All of you. I know this has been a rough few years. I never anticipated the War of the Sisters, as it's being called. I never wanted it. But it's over now. Time to make to build a strong nation. A peaceful one. One day, we may reunite with our sister world. I want that to be a good day. We'll make history. It won't be easy. I sought revenge for so long, I don't know what else there is. But there's work to do here, and friends, a new life to live. My hope is to build something better. Every step I've taken has been to create a better Lachium. I have only one other thing to see too. One last use to the and one last time to use the time spinner. Linnaeus? You're alive! And I'm sorry I could not I could not succeed in save anyone uh, everyone. Time spinner broke. But I got revenge. I killed Emperor Nubius. So you've come back to hell and you've come back to us. I can't stay. After what I've been through, this isn't my time anymore. I think it belongs somewhere else. Lakim is in chaos now. You, my clan, my family, can live in peace. The time spinner may have broken, but I hope you won't ever need it again need it again. I only wish I could have killed him sooner, before he came. I just came back to say goodbye and to pay my respects. Thank you, Mother. I'll miss you always. Hey, you need to grow up and stop being an ass. There won't be any more time messengers, but the clan will still need people like us. And it isn't about being a hero so everyone respects and likes you. It's about giving up everything you have so that those you care about can have it better. Okay, though. I didn't understand that at first, either. You can be that for them. I hope you do all by us. Good luck. Well, that's an ending. It's obviously not the best ending. Uh, in order for that, I would probably have to 100% the game. Um, but it's an ending. Omar is saying show other end to I think I can do that. I was planning to go until 3 a.m. my time. I am at least going to do the throne one. And then I might find a time to 100% um, the game. But I'm not going to be doing that tonight. But yeah, um, this is not a very long game. We've been going for about five hours. A little bit short of that. So I think this this will actually time pretty well with Length of the Past, if I'm going to be honest. Like, especially if I'm not going through all of the story stuff. I can probably get this done in like... Three or four hours. Yeah, the, this is this is gonna time really well with uh, how long to beat dot com. Of course, there's a website like that. I'll I'll check that out after the credits are done.
of all the people who have uh, supported the development of this game. Dang it. And all the people who have supported the development. I was under the average time. Hmm. All right. Let me see if I can spot Zero's name. I know Zero's real name. But I'm not gonna say it. Five hours, 40 minutes of median. Okay. And that's just for a simple playthrough, not like 100%. Okay. Alright, I guess I'm I guess I'm good at this game. <laughs> yeah, um Oh you're so cool. Thank you, Jewel. Um the next uh the next Sunday, uh, the next Sunday Super Shuffle that we do, um, I'm probably going to be playing Time Spinner. Not, not this coming Sunday. Uh, I'm probably going to be doing Risk of Rain 2 because it's shorter. Uh, just because of the whole, you know, desert bus is happening, uh, and I'm not going to be streaming my end. Um, but. Two Sundays from now, I'm going to be doing Time Spinner for sure. Uh, and from then on, it's going to be uh, part of the weighted settings. That's Copycat Zero, but that's not uh, that's not the real Zero. Kind of interesting to see if uh, if I end up being a name that I actually recognize. Of course, it's also entirely possible that. Uh... Okay. Derek George? <laughs> I've seen a couple of uh, the third on this list. It's kind of interesting. Enjoy our game. Eric Berger Carlson, Eric Fluffer, Fluffler Carlson. I really wish I could say that I was on this list, but unfortunately I am not. I only found out about this game at all from Archipelago, so. Gideon Glass, I like that name. And by the way, um, by by this point, at some point between the beginning and now, uh, Zero's name did come up. I did see it. Which, you know... <laughs> doesn't really narrow it down all that much.
it, it is kind of unfortunate they have this huge list of names and it's like well i want to be respectful and run the entire credit at least once yeah a lot of johns too johns and jonathan's johnny herdick i love cat girls good for you john joshua dick Just in a rage at game, Vasquez. Kevin, hello. And here's where I would show up if I had backed this game. Unfortunately, I didn't. Because I didn't know about it. I think if I had known about it, I totally would have backed this. This, this, was, this was a good play. The Leonard Dylan Morrill Combs the Fourth. That's a name with some prestige as fuck to it. Magus 80. I feel like I've seen that name before. Matt Younger. Matthew Chakrates Montgomery. Matthew Emmanuel M. Anthony Rambersad. Michael Dave Sucks Clark. Michael Big Daddy of Telus D'Angelo. Big Daddy. Michael Ho and Michael Ho Jinryu. Michael! Mo. Mr. B. Murph. Nick the Haku Papa uh, Papuga Toaster Tank No Oscar Feskander Feskandler and Lilia Jarl Ten Ten I wonder if Teller is on here too Baron Pierre up of U3 R Reg 21 Row Richard J. Leg Jr. And don't worry, I'm not going to be running through the entire credits again uh, when we go through the other ending. Samaraus, aka Scare Bear. SD Tim. Sean. Say. Scenario. Shadar. Shane Zed. Derwin, Skybob, Slim Keepy, Sleeping Ninja Toast, and Lunchbox, Lunchbox Jelly, and Palm. We're all chipping in to make this Stormwind the Russian Decepticon. <laughs> okay. So here come the teas. Is Teller in here? Uh, apparently not. That ninja. Tim. 
Timothy Clark Vaughn Gal II. Tom, Tom Catbot. Rev T.S. Tsukiji. Trilic. Un, Un. Will of Frozen Storm Buck. William Curi wins Terry. And here we are at the Zeds. New Game Plus and Nightmare Mode have been unlocked. its foes with an orifice. That's exactly what I thought it would be. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just face tank this to death at this point, just restart. I started with a weapon that I wasn't used to. I can see it being pretty good. It's just very short range. It's probably pretty strong if it hits. The problem is it wasn't hitting. <laughs> I'm really not sure how I'm supposed to get past that. Alright. Oh jeez. Ow. Oh no. I've lost all my <laughs> Okay. I should probably go buy some more. Give us some time to try as the Empire Empire Orb. And right, so it's it's a decently strong attack. It's just kind of an awkward range to it.
Where's the... Yeah, you're just gonna give me another quest, I imagine. Yeah, you're just giving me another quest. Concerning. Get some tail. That should be more than enough supplies. Uh. If you don't fail dramatically. There's this whole pine again. I mean, at least this time if I die, um, it just gives me all my items back. Another level can't hurt. Decision platforming. My one true weakness. Yeah, I. Th this is like. Extremely precision. I feel like they, they didn't need to go to wipe this level. Of course, doing that definitely helps. Actually, I wonder if I could go you over here. Or am I gonna have to keep doing this? Oh no. No! Hmm, I ran out of sand. He just wants the kettle. Oh, 
Oh my fuck. Let's not die before I even get there. There's another one of these. Okay. We made it back. Still not sure how I'm supposed to avoid that. I just need being imprudent. Double jump too early. Stop too late. I didn't heal that time. I bought all of those items and then I didn't heal. No, I'll stay here. I am the rightful heir. I can avenge my mother and right the wrongs of my father. I've mastered time. Lucky him will follow me now. Those rocket first. Not all the not all the lucky Emmy accepted the transfer of power, but then I was pronounced to be the eternal mother made flesh, come to save Lucky M. I went with it. After all, I had mastered time. My actions in the past had made Lucky M weak, but it had a lot of potential. Potential my father had squandered. I'd seen how good rulers could lead for Melana. Start building the site for this for the stranded relations. Aristotle, I understand that you that you volunteered to lead the, the effort in rooting out what uh, demons remain? Yes, your highness. Thank you. We will form a joint task force, uh, the first step toward reuniting our peoples. To all of you, I know this has been a rough few years. I never anticipated this war of the sisters as, as it's being called. I never wanted it. But it's over now. It's time to build a strong nation and a peaceful one. One day, we may reunite with our sister world. I want that day to be a good day. Do you think we'll see her again? I don't know. There's something driving her deep down. I don't think this was ever to be her time. At least she said she did some good here. I'll miss her. I'll miss her too. I hope she's happy wherever she is. With this declaration, I abolished the Lakiemi Scientific Advancement Department, which failed to protect Lakiemi's best interests by pursuing knowledge at any cost. 
In its place, the Nellist Fund for Alchemy and Understanding will continue to, pr to pursue advancement, but with protections and empathy for, for all the Lakiani people. Genza said there are, still, there are demons still in Lakiem. We will find them and force them out if we can. It won't be easy. I sought revenge for so long. I don't know what else there is. I never truly understood how lonely it would be to be a time messenger. The sacrifice is not small. I have no one now. My only hope is to build something better. Every step I've ever taken was to create a better Lachium. What else is there now? I have only one other thing to see to. Aeneas? You're alive! I am. I'm sorry I could not succeed and save everyone. The time spinner broke. But I got revenge. I killed Emperor Nubius. So you've come back to us. I can't stay. Nubius was my father. And as his daughter, I now rule Lachium. Lachium will leave this world now so that you, my clan, my family, can live in peace. The time spinner may have broken. But you won't ever need it again. I only wish I could have killed him sooner. Before he came, I just came back to say goodbye and to pay my respects. Thank you, Mother. I'll miss you always. Hey, you need to grow up and stop being an ass. There won't be any more time messengers. But the clan will still need people like us. And it isn't about being a hero who say it's, it, it, it isn't about being a hero so everyone respects and likes you. It's about giving up everything you have so that those you care about can have it better. It's okay though. I didn't understand it at first either. You can be that for them. I hope you do well by us. Good luck. So it's not that much different. There's there's a couple of differences, but it's mostly pretty much the same. I assume that was your second time killing him for the other ending, I guess? Yes. Ah. Uh, interesting timing. Yeah, I came in right as you are killing the big man himself. <laughs> um, are there other endings, yes or no? don't think so you kill okay. him at least at that point i think you just have the two choices right i'm trying yeah. to think if there was anyone anywhere else but but i'm just wondering uh, I'm mostly wondering if there's something like a different ending for 100 percent or something mm. i don't think there was i don't remember one though okay all right. Well, in that case, uh, I think that's going to be the end of the stream. And I think we can call this stream a success. My computer didn't lock up randomly. And how long has it been going for now? Uh, almost five uh, and a half hours? Yep, just about uh, well, a little Me? more than that. I was a little worried because I got a notification from Twitch that you were streaming. It like popped up like an hour ago, and I'm thinking... Uh oh. Yeah. Do you have to it, restart it? I think it does that sometimes. Like it's it's done that for for J pop for me a couple of times. Okay. Just Twitch being Twitch then. Yeah. But yeah, uh I think this will time really well with uh with Link to the Pass as far as uh, Archipelago. Because yeah. that usually goes about four or five hours, and it took me about five hours to finish the game. And yep, if, if I take out the, the break, if I if I take out the break, if I take out all the story stuff, because I was oh, yeah. reading all that, and I didn't even get all of it. Um, yeah, not not having to read all the documents and, and go back to the library multiple times to unlock the remaining ones. That definitely is a lot of the time spent. Yeah, although 
you know, w once I'm randomizing, um, it is actually possible to use your tablet to download items. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Oh. So, uh, let me turn that on. Let's give it a try at least. Um, well, at the very least, you still don't have to read. You don't have to read anything. You can do the download and you just get past it. Yeah, exactly. Uh, but yeah, um, I am probably going to see if I can do an, at least one more stream of this game at some other point. Just to kind of clear things out, do like all the quests and stuff. Um, but I think I'm done for tonight. So, um, go off to the shutdown screen. So, I want to thank y'all for watching. The next scheduled stream is going to be not, not this Sunday, but next Sunday uh, with the Sunday Super Shuffle where I'm going to be playing this game at randomized and in a multi-world setting. Um, after that, the next stream after uh, uh, that's going to be on Sunday at 7.30 p.m. Atlantic Standard Time. Uh, the next stream after that, uh, the uh, long run on Tuesday at 9 p.m. Atlantic Standard Time. We're finally going to be starting with Zero Time Dilemma. And uh, after that, the uh, I'm going to try to come up with something for Code Creator, but I'm not really sure what right Uh, So yeah, that's gonna about do it. Uh, thank everyone for being here. Who did we have? We had Xylem on fire, Sim Guy, Mazzy, uh, Jewel. I think that's everyone. Tyrion. Else. Tyrion, yes, thank you. And uh, with that, I'm Coolio if you don't know, along with Zero. Yep, thanks for watching. And see you guys next time.